Good afternoon, Southwest Florida. This is the Naples Herald Lunch Break. I'm Janelle Simmons. Today we have a flood warning, voters with another chance, and more. Today is Thursday, January 28th, and this is the Lunch Break. The National Weather Service has issued a flood watch in Collier with possible heavy rainfall today after the area was canvassed with 3 to 5 inches yesterday. The flood watch will be in effect through this evening and a cold front will move into the region later, providing even more possibilities for heavy rainfall. Try and stay safe, warm, and dry. Voters will get another chance to decide whether to allow medical marijuana in Florida after backers of a proposed constitutional amendment finish submitting enough valid petition signatures to get on the November ballot. According to the Florida Division of Elections website, supporters of the proposal have turned in nearly 693,000 valid signatures, almost 10,000 more than needed to get on the ballot. Here we go, round two. Almost 3,000 young children across the country will receive a special mentor through the Boys and Girls Club's new STEM mentoring program across the nation, including the organization's branch in Collier County. The Boys and Girls Club of Collier County announced on Monday that the program will take place thanks to a new partnership with C Research Foundation and funding from the Department of Justice's Office of Juvenile Justice and Delinquency Prevention. Although their programs are prominent in the local area, the organization is always looking for more adult interested in changing the lives of the local youth. If interested, visit Naples Herald for more information. That was the lunch break for today. I'm Janelle Simmons. The lunch break airs Monday through Friday at 12 p.m. right here at NaplesHerald.com. And don't forget to check out our morning report that also is Monday through Friday at 8 a.m. Thank you for watching. We'll see you tomorrow.